path four ways I'm making money in GTA 5 line starting off here with the clock and bell right now if you want a whole entire video about the setups and everything top right corner click on that video I'll show you how to do it every now the setups are kind of boring and annoying but eventually once you get to the end of it right here and it's the finale you can go the silent and sneaky way or the aggressive way it's up to you the reason why I just made my video because it's the top four ways of making money in GTA 5 line this is by far one of the most easiest ways minus the setups so I'm doing it the stealth way it made it a lot easier because no NPC is trying to net me every three seconds to keep on responding so I recommend doing a stealth way it's so darn easy that you can probably get this done faster and faster every time you do it so i got myself the cane i got myself the packages and i got myself the money so i got myself out of there had myself a haggard gosh darn van so i said you know what this minivan we out so i delivered it to big v and bada boom bada bing five hundred thousand dollars this is my second time doing this give me a total of a million dollars plus so after making myself a million dollars plus we do the cluck and bell raids i decided to come over here to my gosh darn little bunker and i had myself well over eight hundred thousand dollars of los santos now the mission i wanted is the one i'm gonna get right here is one with the two trucks listen i'm about to show you something that's gonna make you a little sad okay and may i say don't you ever do this one i'm about to show you right here the first truck here listen i'm gonna deliver it squeaky clean not a problem so once i delivered it i was at the airport and i saw a cargo bob and i said hey this will get me to the other truck pretty darn fast right so it did now if you didn't know the cargo bob picks up things puts it down you know it's like a big old crane it just brings stuff everywhere so i said you know what let me use my big brain that happens to be small like a walnut and said hey let me pick up the back of this truck let's see how fast we can get there with this baby right here never done this before so this is all new to me i started giving it up and i started shaking like a fat guy on a tight line right there listen i am showing you this so you don't make the same mistake as me first off you don't ever use a cargo bot to deliver cargo especially when it's this big. also you don't fly over water with your cargo ever now at this point right here i was panicking i was getting sweaty i said you know what i'm in a heap of trouble right here listen this is eight hundred thousand dollars right here four hundred thousand dollars floating and i don't understand rockstar why can this cargo bob not bring this right here listen gravity not a thing look at this look at this it's just titanic the titanic has sink look at this is just sad listen i'll be honest with you <laughs> gta 6 comes up never playing this game ever again i decided to pull up my ethernet cable maybe it wouldn't uh, just be honest with you, I'm done. i thought it worked that i pulled my ethernet cable didn't save but guess what it sure as hell did and just let you know i'm never playing this game ever again when gta 6 comes out this game is going to be vaulted so after that high blood pressure event i decided to come over here as my nightclub because i usually utilize this thing all the time because it makes me a lot of money okay i want to know how much money you made for the nightclub alone i think i made well, actually i'm not sure how much money i made let's check it out here come on let's get the computer a little bit faster this is both of us 41 million dollars this is actually not that bad so i have 319 thousand dollars we'll around two hundred thousand dollars plus for the seller here because tony takes ten percent listen tony tens we call him okay and i had an easy sell mission in three locations i had to go to in an invite only session listen easy peasy lemon squeezy we're not talking about the bunker event that thing never happened so bada boom bada bing again two hundred thousand dollars plus because tony ten tony got some of the money from me okay so i thought i came over here to my acid labs aka my stinky farts lab and i had three hundred fifty one thousand dollars shown here every time i jump in gta 5 line and i always refill this thing because it's an easy three hundred fifty one thousand dollars when it's double money and rp you look at yourself seven hundred thousand dollars plus if i can do math correct so i got to my last package right here threw it in the bin like no other and bada boom about a bing got myself out of there listen no high blood pressure on this one still we're not talking about the bunker mission still sad about it but we're not going to talk about it three hundred fifty one thousand dollars listen i've had four ways of making money in gta 5 line i'll be doing this and make sure when you get yourself a bunker don't ever use a cargo bot to sell your deliveries because listen you're gonna crash or that you're gonna find yourself at the bottom of the ocean it's one or the other but if you want to make yourself even more money in gta 5 line especially Especially with the God Star Cluck and Bell raid, you want to know the whole entire setup? Check out this video right here. I show you exactly do it, and I catch you on it.